Well, I had Dell <clears throat> take a look. He remote connected to it, remotely connected to it, and um, he just uninstalled the OC controls, redownloaded it from the web page, same version I was, and installed it and went to it a different way. Um, instead of going to the start menu, he went to just to the search and then clicked on uh, the magnifying glass and searched in for the command center and then loaded it and then it brought up. But he did wait about a solid 10 seconds or so before he did anything on the computer. So he went to here and then typed in And see, I might have done it wrong. Cause it loaded without the other stuff in yet. There it goes. Now it should have popped up something to let me click OK. Um, I have throttle stop delayed for a minute. This I is the one that, you know, um, so that it's supposed to bring up. We'll see if that does anything. It took a little bit of time. Then I guess in the event that it doesn't work, um, a restart. It's definitely not a very stable program. Oh, I'll tell you that much right now. I need to clean my screen. Alright, so we're at the login. We'll go ahead and log in. We'll wait 10 seconds here or so. Alright, and then we'll go to here, type in command. And we'll load our command center. Yeah, it does. It just makes you resize it. And then it should pop up a screen for me to click yes or no. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah. So, so that 
think, don't you think what's wrong? There it is. Then we click yes. And then he had gone and clicked on fusion. And I know it took a little bit of time here too. there we go. Now if we go back to our home, the throttle and thermal, or the thermal and the overclock controls work. And I've tested this at least seven different times now and it's always worked this way, but for some reason when I turn the computer on from a uh, cold boot, it doesn't work. So once I load it, restart it and then uh, I have to wait at least about 13 seconds then it will load the FX and I did do a delay on throttle stop but uh, that's been the workaround so far I did it exactly how the Dell guy did it I even said will it work if you restart it so he restarted it and it worked so it took about the same amount of time but it is working